Our next speaker, he can't be here today in person. Uh, he's going to video in, but it's a friend of mine, uh, Justin Gorini. Justin and I grew up together. He is a Lenape alum. He has had a 20 plus year successful career in the entertainment industry, which I would say is as hard, maybe even harder of getting in as professional sports. So Justin is a guy who was the first runner up on American Idol. He has done Broadway. He has done film and entertainment. He is now a best selling author. Uh, on a personal note, I've known Justin since we were young. And one thing I can say for Justin, as you've heard from some of our other speakers, Justin always had goals, even at an early age. He was the kid. He was singing the national anthem at our games. He was never missing an opportunity to work on his craft. He had a very clear, defined goal of where he wanted to go, even from an early age. So uh, as wonderful he is, excuse me, as wonderful a talent as he is, he is a better person. I see him often, and uh, I always get the same guy, big smile on his face, lots of positivity. So Justin's going to, is he zooming in, or is this a recording, no. Mike? Okay, it's a video, so if everyone turn your attention to the screen, we're going to hear from Justin Guarini. Good afternoon, everyone. It's great to be here with you virtually to speak with you about an important topic that is close to my heart. Today, I'd like to share with you some ideas about why a career in the arts could be right for you. A career in the arts can offer you new and unexpected ways to break out of the more traditional kinds of jobs that you'll be hearing about today from the great lineup of speakers that are here. Now, I know, wait, you might be thinking, wait, 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 the arts, that's just for people who want to be famous, but I actually couldn't be further from the truth. The arts community is so much more than just Hollywood actors and pop stars. In fact, it's actually a diverse and inclusive community that offers many different paths and opportunities for success. And well, I know that the challenges that many of you are facing today at the age you're at and the time in history that we're at feel like they're never ending. And that sometimes, if not a lot of the time, you feel like you're doing it alone. And the idea of taking on like one more responsibility in the real world, no matter what job interests you here, or what line of work interests you here, it just can feel overwhelming. My 18 year old is about to graduate high school from West and she's excited but also terrified of what comes next. But hey, that's life and life can be tough and it can be hard to find a supportive and accepting community sometimes. And that is where the arts community comes in. It's a place where people come together to express themselves, support each other and create something beautiful together. So whether you're a painter or a dancer or a musician or a writer, there is a place for you in the arts community. And another one of the great things about the arts is that there are so many different ways to express yourself like maybe you're not interested in traditional art forms like painting or sculpture and that's okay there are plenty of other ways to get creative maybe you're into graphic design a lot of money there or you like to write poetry maybe you love to dance but you don't want to do ballet and that is absolutely okay too there are so many different styles of dance from hip-hop to ballroom and everything in between the point is, is that there are so many great ways to express yourself and Look, speaking of self-expression, let's not forget about the benefits of self-expression. The arts offers a unique opportunity to explore your feelings and emotions in a safe and supportive environment in a healthy way. Look, whether you're feeling sad, happy, angry, or confused, there is a form of artistic expression that can help you make sense of your feelings and, again, find a way to express them in a healthy way. A life and a career in the arts can help you discover new things about yourself and the world, as well as help you recover from the wounds of the past so you can create the future that you desire. But wait, let's get down to brass tacks. What about success and money in the arts? I mean, come on, let's get real. Isn't that success and that money, isn't that just for the stars? No, not at all. There's so many different jobs and roles within the arts community that can lead to a fulfilling, most important, and successful career. Look, maybe you want to be a set designer or a lighting technician or a costume designer. Maybe you want to work in arts administration, helping manage and promote cultural events. Maybe you want to be a teacher, passing on your love of the arts to the next generation. Again, there's so many different ways that you can be a part of the arts community especially if you hate the idea of getting up on the stage or in front of the camera, but love the idea of being part of a show or a production. 
I mean, what a lot of people don't know is that what you see on the screen, uh, on the stage, and in countless arts productions is supported by hundreds and sometimes thousands of creatives and artists. So as you can see, the arts offer a world of opportunity for those who are willing to explore it. And I want to encourage you to do just that. Don't be afraid to try something new, to express yourself in a different way, or to pursue a career in the arts. You might just find that it offers you a sense of hope and direction in life that you might not know that you've been looking for. I'm so happy to be able to be here, even if it isn't in person, because I get to pass on a message that completely changed my life. And I hope that you get this one thing. You don't have to be a star to be successful in the arts. The arts community is diverse, inclusive, welcoming to everyone. And there's so many different ways to express yourself and many, many different paths to success. So I encourage you to go out there and explore the world of the arts. Who knows where it might take you and who knows how many people you can inspire and how many people's lives you can change just by doing something that you love, expressing yourself in your own unique way. I want to thank you for your time. And thanks to my coach from my Lenape days of football, Coach Benstead, for inviting me to be a part of this event. Be well. And I wish you all the very best.